Hey, it's another day, another Tears of the Kingdom video. We have just landed on Hyrule, so I am super excited to explore the area. Uh, I'm kind of curious as to see what has changed since the last time we were here, aka in Breath of the Wild. Now where to? There's like a little structure this way, but I don't know what it... On my map, but I don't know what that means. Kingdom. That is so cool. It's... Can't do anything with these. Wow. So now what? change map layers with up and down oh okay cool so we still have the sky level and then we have the surface level oh i wonder if there's like a below the surface level uh but we don't have anything showing us where we're at so i guess we just need to explore interesting to play through the Hyrule that we are familiar with with these new abilities. Oh, what on earth was that? Are things just falling out of the sky? Well, yeah, I can pick it up. What the heck? what I'm supposed to do with that. I did see a treasure chest down here, though. How come I can't get it? Okay. It's failure. shield. What is this thing? <laughs> Some logs down here, too. Um, I don't know, though. I roll herb. This healthy herb has not changed since ancient times. Cook it before eating to increase the number of hearts it restores. There's Hyrule Castle, looking very interesting. Pretty. 
There's all kinds of like giant blocks and boulders and stuff. I really don't know where I'm supposed to go or what I'm supposed to do. I mean, find Zelda, yeah, but Ooh, what's this thing? Oh, fire fruit. Oh, it's a bogoblin. Can I get, can I pick him up? How about... No, I can't do any of that. Can I do anything to him? Well, pretty easy to get rid of. A goblin horn, a sharp horn with multiple barbs. Attach it to a weapon to increase its attack power or cook it with a critter to make an elixir. Well, I guess you can't use your abilities on bad guys. Unfortunately. Uh, well, there's a shrine this way. There's shrines all over the place. What? <laughs> this thing threw him. It says, Okoblin Fang. It's worn down and not very sharp, but it's still pretty hard. Cook it with a critter to make an elixir or attach it to an arrow to increase its attack power. Let's do that. Goblin Fang. <laughs> Rock Hammer, an average sword used largely by travelers. The blade has decayed, but it can still serve its purpose. How come I can't pick it up? I guess I... Yeah, I don't have any more room. Moblin horn. A hard horn that resulted from a skull mutation. Attach it to a weapon to increase its attack power or cook it with a critter to make an elixir. Ooh, what's over here at their little fort? Some arrows. And there's a tre treasure chest. Okay. Is that a shrine over there? Wasn't there one over here? Maybe that's the one I saw, huh? Don't know. Hey, it's a Mario mushroom. Hylian shroom. A common mushroom found near trees around Hylia. Or Hyrule. Wow. Eat it to restore half a heart. Can I shield surf in this? Oh, yeah, I sure can to shield surf. Yep. Woohoo! <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> I'm glad they kept that in the game. Rusty broadsword. This is like. Oh, you can build a. A wagon? High roll restoration restoration materials. Use this materials cash for all your building needs. Come find us if you'd like a dream home. Hudson Construction. Awesome. So we get to we get to like build a car? Seriously? Uh
Let's do this. Oh, come on, guys. Leave me alone. Uh, where's my... have any weapon. First of all, let's eat something. There we go. Now let's get a sword. Oh, there's a blood moon too. What? Eat some more food. What is this? Sandilian. A wild plant that grows in the sun at high altitudes, soaked in sunlight, its petals can restore health depleted by gloom when used in cooking. Coming for you, buddy. Yeah, see ya. Boko bow, a basic bo bokoblin bow made of wood. It's made by taking any tree branch and just tying a string to either end. So don't expect much in the way of combat effectiveness. Uh, what's all this over here? Ooh, gross. Bunch of bones. Rusty shield. Ooh, there goes the star. Oko shield. A bokoblin made shield created by attaching a hand hold to any flat tree bark picked up off the ground. It's pretty shoddy, so don't expect it to last very long. There's a bunch of arrows on the ground. Okay, so let's do this. We're going to rotate this. Oh, well, did not want to do that. Okay. Oh boy. So the blood moon is when all the creatures that you've killed come back to life. Uh, we know that from the last Zelda. And it's pretty kind of creepy. Yeah, so... Oh, wow. Witness the blood moon's rise. Oh, that's a lot more intense than the last when time. red glow shines upon the land, the aimless spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. What are those? Just as they did in a war long past. The world is threatened once again. That is cool. Yeah, they're all back. <laughs> um. Come on, guys, leave me alone. Oh, 
Oh, they blew themselves up. Hmm. Maybe they'll forget about me. And they did. Splash them with water. He's dead. I'm just gonna leave the other guy over there. I don't really care about him because he's not gonna come after me. I do this or do I do it like this If it's on, will it? Uh, what are you doing? That's not what I wanted to do at all. This is ridiculous. Uh, huh. So now, do you... this back here. I have no idea what I'm doing. Alright, well this is clearly not going to work. Because for a lot of reasons. The jankiest thing I've ever seen in my life. And it doesn't roll anywhere. You got me. I, I don't know what I'm doing.
Where was that a shrine at? Can we at least do that? Down here somewhere, wasn't it? There's bokoblins everywhere. He's got bombs. Wow. Okay, let's eat some food. Shoot it. Oh, hey, buddy. You dropped some coins. The rupee. Five rupees. It's shiny blue facets make you weak in the knees. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's that shrine. There's a cave over here. Let's check this out. Oh, wow. <laughs> that was pretty darn cool. Uh oh. Oh, what is that thing? Ranch ruins. Oh, that thing is crazy. What was that? Horriblin horn. An elongated hammer shaped horn with a hard flat front. Attach to a weapon to increase attack power, or cook it with a critter to make an elixir. That guy was crazy looking. Ooh, what are these? Bright cap, a mushroom that grows in caves and contains luminescent enzymes. Cook it into a dish to give a glowing effect to anyone who eats it. I wonder what we'd use that for. Traveler's Bow, a small bow used by travelers for protection. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it can be used to attack foes from a distance. We will take it. Oh, what's up here? Green rupee. A single rupee, its soft green glow puts a smile on your face. Ooh, that was cool. Let's go up here. There's a giant chunk of meat. Just hang, hang it out. We'll take it. Oh, you can hear the rain outside. That's pretty neat. Traveler's sword. An average sword used largely by travelers. The blade has been, de or has decayed, but it can still serve its purpose. Well, let's certainly replace that. Okay, oh, there's more stuff up here. Oh, we know this guy. He's the bubble frog, or booble. Booble? Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Ooh, 
I wanted to catch him. That's cool. Get them marching together. So I guess I came out the other side of the cave. So if that's the case, can I just go through the ceiling? Yeah, I can. Wow. Okay, I really want to get to that shrine over there. I think that's the way I'm supposed to be going. Avoid these guys for now. What's this? Rusty Halberd. A rusty pole arm likely used by knights from an age past. The spearhead is in bad shape due to prolonged exposure to the elements, so its durability is low. Oh, there's some deer. Ah, what is that thing? Whoa! <laughs> what? It's a tree! Is it an int? No, don't do that. Let's get my... thick stick a solid thick cut or stick cut from a crooked branch of a tough tree it has high durability despite the way it looks okay let's oh. hulu tree nut Small birds love this nut. You can eat it raw for a minor effect, but it can also be added as a spice to other recipes. That tree was cool. I've never seen that before. Always checking for Koroks. This is our first shrine in Hyrule, so this will be interesting to see what Geocean Shrine. Skip. Shape rotation. Hey. Nothing down there. What is this thing? <laughs> oh, can I? Oh, can I fuse that to a, a different... Gosh, so did I just ruin it then? Yeah. Well, how do I get past the shrine now? Uh, 
Uh, that's... Oh, it came back. Weird. Okay, now what do we do with this thing? Wasn't too bad. There's your chest up there. I cannot. Sometimes the way he grabs these things is really awkward and I there we go. I can't get it to do what I want it to do, but... What's this? Okay. Can I climb it? I can't even climb on it? Are you kidding? Can I go through it? I can, that's cool. <laughs> Hasty Elixir grants a mid-level haste effect which boosts your movement speed while running, swimming, or climbing. these days I'm going to figure out these controls. Uh, how am I supposed to do this? That's close. Maybe? No? What on earth? <laughs> oh, is that supposed to go through there? Clearly I need it. I wish you could, like, ro rotate it that way. But you can't. How am I supposed to do this? Oh! There we go. Crazy. 
Let me set this over here. Okay. Do that. There you go. Well, I guess I made it. This is so weird. Okay, that's our first shrine in Hyrule. I have a feeling they're just going to get more and more difficult with like the different shapes and using all the powers that we have. Well, kind of disappointed. I mean, not much has changed since Breath of the Wild. That it's really pretty much the same uh, aside from well, that cave monster, he was new. Oh, and the the tree that attacked us, that was that was new too. Uh, oh, and the boulders everywhere falling out of the sky. Oh, and the pile of material that we could build a wagon or try to build a wagon with. And the blood moon was different. And the...